Hello everyone. In this session, we'll discuss inner class, or it is also termed as nested class. Now, inner class means a class within a class. So, inner class are instance of a spatial in relationship with outer class, wherein the inner class can access the members of the outer class as if they are part of the outer class. Now, additionally, it can access all the members of the outer class, including the private data members. So over here, this inner class are helpful to access the private members also because we are knowing that private members cannot be accessed outside the class. Yes, it is true, but within the inner class, it can be accessed. So over here, the syntax for defining inner class is we are defining an outer class and the inner class, same what we discussed, the outer class. So this is the simple syntax. Let us see an example for the inner class. So a class outer is there within which we are declared word integer variable outer x whose value is 100. Then we are defining inner class whose con we are defining inner class which contains a method display. We want to display the value of outer x which is there outside the inner class. Then we are writing one method test within the outer class and in that test we are making an object of inner class. So inner, inner equals to new inner and we are calling this display method. So inner dot display. So inner dot display will call this display method and this display method will display the value of outer x which is the value of outer class. So now in this case public static void main we want to declare for that we are making another class public class inner class demo and we are making an object of outer class. So outer, outer equals to new outer and we are calling the method test of the outer class using the object so outer dot test so it will call this particular test method in which we had made an object of inner class and using that object we are calling the display method and this display method will access the member outer x of the outer class whose value is 100 and it would be displayed so this is what is the concept of inner class, a class within a class. The main usage of this inner class is to access the private members of the outer class and it can be accessed within the inner class. So that is the only usage of inner classes and this can be used in the concept of event handling in Java also. So thank you all of you.